about you, Sophia. You being the writer, director, Latina who came here legally, did this must have felt like a big f you. What was your inspiration? Well, it goes back to 2017, you know, with Meryl's Globe speech, very inspiring. You know, especially because my father was disabled and uh, he died a year later and I was unable to make it to his funeral. I tried climbing the wall, you know, it was being built that time and I fell. I fractured my arm, my hips, my head and I died briefly, but I died. Wow. But hey, I'm a survivor. Here I am. Whoa! <laughs> Welcome to the zoo, guys. Thank you for being Hi, here. Thank, thank you. you for having us. Yeah. Of course. She died and she's here now. Yeah, she made it back from the dead. I don't know how. We do miracles here. Okay, folks, you know what to do. One, two, three. Wow! Oh, <laughs> so before Nelly. we get into some of the things, some of the work that you're doing together, um, you had an opinion about our conversation on astrology. What is oh, it? Oh, yeah. Oh, wow. <laughs> uh, actually, I mean, I, I like the, uh, the idea that you were talking about it scientifically. Mm -hmm. I do believe in the pull, I mean, of a forces on your body right. and on you, you know defining you and and so I do think that you have to you there is a little bit of truth in it but you would have to go deeper than you know the newspaper horoscope. <laughs> no, I, uh, signs though. Let me wait. Let me guess your signs. Let me guess your yeah, signs. You're a Virgo. Do we think no. about that? Okay, we'll get back to you. You're okay. a fire sign for sure. Okay. I'm, no, I'm actually Taurus. Oh. I'm I was gonna Whoa. say Taurus after you said. I gave you the, I see and I'm though. Scorpio. <laughs> wait. So, Ooh, yeah. that means he's a lover and a very Ooh. very exciting. Ooh. But is, we are the opposite, but. What are uh, no, you? We've been together 27 days. 27 years. days. <laughs> <laughs> it still feels like that, that's a good Sorry, thing for him. I to get nervous here. It feels perfect. like 27 days. You guys yeah. have a beautiful marriage. I've known you from before. Nice. We, you know, we've, we've hang out before with other people that we have in common. What's the, the little trick to this marriage? Because not everybody can make it. No. Tell well, it yeah, 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 tell, tell them, tell them. Tell them. Tell them. It's a contract now. <laughs> no, no, it's basically. What would you say, though? What would I say? One, that you have to be compatible, not so much that you do the same things. That's a mis big mistake. Okay. Okay. He's a rocker. I'm not. You know okay. what I'm saying? Yeah. So it's like, it, what, but I can appreciate what he does. I love the, the la language and his songs and et cetera, et cetera. That, but that's not the point. The point is that you view the world and your interest and in, in what's important and essential in the world, you, you share. Okay. That I think you have to. And actually respect. That you, there's not a day that goes by that you don't feel respect for your partner. Right. You know, because that is what erodes quickly, you know, if you don't watch it. You have to mm. renew, renew, renew. Like, remind yourself, why did I love him and fell in love with him in the first place? Wait, what about lo físico, lo físico? ¿Qué fue lo que tú le viste a ella y viceversa? Porque ella dijo, ella dijo, le vi la barbita y me encantó. ¿Qué fue lo que te atrajo de él? No, no, no. Wow, no, lo que, lo que le ven. No, eh, eh, puedes en decir. Sí, claro. sí, ah. No, este, el, la conocí cuando fue a hacer el casting para, este, como para, para el chocolate, chocolate a México. Mi, mi padre es el director y yo era el hijo del ah. director. Ah, no. wow. No, y entonces nos, nos empezamos a ver. No, me encantó. A mí, luego, físicamente me, me encantó. Me gustan las mujeres, mujeres con curvas ah, y, y, y con un ingrediente que, que si se combina es peligroso. Sí, es, es, yo lo veo. Inteligencia. A little, a little, yeah. Inteligencia. A little bit of darkness, in, yeah. just a little bit. A little a darkness bit. in the eyes goes a long way. You, no. You've been in a bunch of great projects. Uh, one that I can recall, Day Without a Mexican. Yes. Um, we recently had a day without a woman. We should actually do a day without a Mexican for real, because that was never done, yes. right? Yeah, well, yeah. no, it's been, they did? It's, it's actually yes. been happening um, nationwide. It's been interesting. They call it a day without Latinos. Or a day without an immigrant. Well, and a day without, without, without an immigrant, immigrant. you know, which yeah. our point when we made the film, a day without a Mexican, mm -hmm. it's very, Mexican is very provocative in mm -hmm. the United States, right? Yeah. Because there's such a history of you know, the, the United States and Mexico and a, a very difficult relationship. Right. So um, we did it on purpose. We met every Latino in the United yeah. States. Mm -hmm. In but the of film course, you can see, see that. that yeah. We're but talking of, about you know, So we were being provocative and as artists we were definitely, you know, sure that that was the title. Not A Day Without Latinos because that sounds very PBS, mm -hmm. you know, yeah. and A, a Day with Im Out Immigrants, it's also kind of National Geographic right. and it's, yeah. I mean, no, no, we're going to, it's like, oh my gosh, what, what are you saying? Well, a Day Without Out Immigrants. And this is a comedy. This is you know. a comedy. That is a, it's like a political cartoon. 
Ours yeah. is a comedy, yeah. That's, that's a big But place. people have done, uh, actually there's been many places, Wisconsin, this is the second yeah. year that they do A Day Without Latinos, and they shut down all of their small businesses, wow. and, and, and really, you know, because the small businesses are being uh, supportive of Latinos and la their Latino workers. So it's been really kind of, I mean, it's 400,000, 500,000 people mm, on the streets wow. of Wisconsin wow. with a day without Latino. Wisconsin, you would think it would be in a bigger <laughs> city, you know? Who would think? In a bigger area, but not, not well, no, Wisconsin. They're, I guess they're there's a lot important. of Latinos out there. Yeah. And now, Yareli, you have a bachelor's degree in politics as well. So then this mm -hmm. is something, is this like a topic that you've always been passionate about? Has it increased now that Donald Trump won and everything that we've been going <laughs> through politically? or how do you feel yes. about it? Yeah, uh, I mean, I, I did study political science, never to be uh, a senator or something like that. It was always about, how. let me learn how power works in, in, in our country, in our world, because that's what politics so is. So then you it's, make movies yeah. about it. And I'll make movies about it. I'll be writing and I'll be, you know, because I was studying theater all the time, all right. along, you know, but it, it, it was like, what, how do you speak about the things that are not spoken about? Mm. And I'm gonna, you know, have to write the script, not because, no, I love I love writing, but I'd rather not write. I love acting more, but I'll have to write it because it's not being written. It's yeah, not it's being so talked about. It's so smart to get that background smart, so many yeah. people don't understand where things come from and, and they just say, oh, maybe it's this, maybe it's that. But no, there are reasons that things happen right. and you can trace them back to the beginning of time, basically, and everything kind of history mm -hmm. works in cycles. So. And combine two passions as well. Yeah, 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 yeah totally. Saying, a lot of people make presumptions when they're writing scripts and stuff like that, but when somebody actually understands the situation. Anything you're working on now or on the horizon that you want to uh, preview us with? Yes. Ooh, um, yep. We are working on another day with that a Mexican. Oh! Hey. This time One it's more personal. Day. <laughs> okay. Nice. It's, this time it's personal. When is, when is that supposed to come out? Do you oh, know? Oh my gosh. Well, we would have loved for it to have come out this year. It's not going to happen just because of the way, um, you know, we've been. We're so independent. Mm -hmm. We're independent filmmakers. But we want to be codependent. Okay. <laughs> He's putting out the word. Codependent like here. Please. You know, uh, so it's tough when you don't have, a, and, and the reason is that we could give away the, the, you know, the right to make another, because people are producers like right. the concept, okay. and it's a proven concept since right. it did well. But we want to write kind of at least the first draft so it's clear where we want to go. So it won't be tainted. Before, it yeah. won't be. Yeah, but because you know what? They always make, they want to make it, a, oh, it's a comedy? Oh, we'll make it like a clown circus. Oh, and it's no. like, uh, it's going to be a dark clown circus. Well, you know what I'm saying? Go, so. Please come back to the zoo when so it's I, ready. Okay, we will. Because we really want to know we'll, all about it, and we are all fans of, we'll of that kind of work. Right. All right. Thank you so much.